Central Ohio Fire Department is facing a new battle once the flames are extinguished. They're struggling to keep firefighters on the job. All new tonight at 6, NBC4's Dan Perlman explains how money plays a big role in keeping that department fully staffed. Here at Newark, 76 of the 79 firefighter positions are filled. The problem isn't filling those spots. The chief says it's keeping people on board. If you ask around town, I think that's terrible. Many people, like Phoebe Phillips, I was not totally unaware of that. Don't know of the issue <laughs> at the firehouse. Since July of 2016, I think we've lost 13 firefighters. And of those 13, Chief Pat Connor says 10 left for higher wages. It's very frustrating. Elsewhere, state records indicate starting salary in Newark is around $35,000. In Lancaster, for example, a similar sized department, it's about $50,000. The chief here says a loss in state funding hurt. The loss of local government funding um, several years ago impacted the city of Newark about $2.4 million every year. So now City Councilman Jeremy Blake wants to pressure the state for help. We need local government funds restored. And maybe let voters locally decide if they want the salaries to rise. At some point, I would be in favor of going back to our local voters if needed to, uh, to increase revenue for that. For now, the chief tells me he's working with the city and the mayor. Absolutely want to fix this. To keep his crew intact, the town. We need police and fire, and we have to pay them. They are now watching. And Councilman Blake tells me he and a colleague are working to set up a forum for the community to come together and to discuss this issue, the date to be determined. Local for you in Newark, Dan Perlman, NBC4.